Maybe Zeus is favoring Sparta after all, if the mighty Eagle Bearer has arrived. And you come to defend our borders against the Athenian scum? You've got my sword, Spartan. Good. We'll need all the iron we can get.
out of my way, young Nistios. Where's that coming from? Let's go.
Should be careful. High security here.
You are you, Cassandra of House Ayad? I am. I am Xanthi, Magistrate of Pitana. I have a noble task befitting someone of your high station. My son is to start his military training at the Agoyi. My husband is away at war, and I have official business to attend to. Can you escort him for me? I can escort your son to the camp, Master. Good. He'll learn how to be a man like his father and brother, or he'll die trying. It will be my honor to take him to begin his education as a Spartan. You are an agent of Zeus. I don't pretend to know the thoughts of the gods, but I'm happy to guide your son. My youngest is a dreamer. His head is filled with boyhood stories. He must learn how to serve his nation first, and then his family. It's not an easy path. He will find glory as a true Spartan soldier, or die bravely in the attempt. There is no greater way to honor Sparta. You'll find the Agogi camp southwest of here, near the foothills of the mountains. Makarios, come here. Hello, I'm Cassandra. I am honored to meet you, Eagle Banner. I can't wait to learn to fight like my brother Theoros, and to hear all your stories of deadly monsters and glorious adventures. This way, Cassandra. The Argogi is up in the mountains, so we get there closer to Olympus. What's it like being a mercenary? I do what I must to get by. My brother said the same thing about being a man in Sparta. We learn to fight, to die for our family and our country. I can't wait. You love your home, eh? I do. We are strong and we are free. And any man would happily give his life for his city, his fellow soldiers and his children. So how many children do you have? Oh, no, none. But when I'm older, I'm going to marry Athena, and we'll have the strongest sons. <laughs> well then. and messy. What of your brother? Theoros? He's the best. He's amazing to watch in the games. He's fast and strong, and he can throw the javelin and discus farther than anyone. Oh, yes? I'm faster than anyone my age, but Theoros is like Heracles himself. He sounds like a god made flesh. He's my hero. He even sings like Orpheus. Do you want to hear me sing? The mother says I sing like a harpy. No, that's okay. I'll be glad to meet him. La -da, la -da 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 -or. <laughs> Kere, I bring you a new charge, trainer. Makarios, son of Serios. Yes, sir. I can't wait to see my brother. Quiet, boy. No questions. You'll focus on your own lessons and duties, and speak when spoken to. Yes, sir. You'll taste dirt and blood here. I'll force you to eat a thousand bitter lessons to harden you into the bronze shield your city needs. Yes, sir. Now, Mistios, you look like you've been in a few scrapes. I don't waste breath describing my exploits or trying to scare children. You speak like a Spartan. Let's see if you've learned anything else. <laughs> 
I'm no child for you to loom over. Feel no shame when you ask for mercy, old man. You won't survive this! <laughs> Fight with the strength of the gods. Now that we know you can fight, I have a serious matter to discuss. Oh? Two of my older students have gone missing. And I need someone I can trust to find them. They should know enough to take care of themselves. Yes. But the world is full of unexpected dangers, and I cannot leave my charges to investigate properly. I can look for them. Tell me what I need to know. What were their last orders? I had sent them to a lookout camp, where they were to survive on their own for a few days. It is up to them to treat it seriously. But when I went to check on them, there was no sign. What dangers did you expect them to face? The students learned to watch for wolves and bears, but I saw no spore. Hmm. Perhaps a different sort of beast. The two students who are missing are called Akamas and Theoros. Theoros? Makarios' brother? The same. I fear I have failed the magistrate. I'll look at the campsite and see what I can find. I'm here to face the kings. Are you ready to take back our family's land? Of course. But my purpose here is to bring down the cultist king. You make your mother proud, Cassandra. But are you sure you have enough proof to accuse him? I'm sure. I'll gather the Ephors and meet you in the throne room. Who are the Ephors? You don't remember? Then again, you were only a child. The five Ephors are elected from the citizens of Sparta. They have power over even the kings. You need to convince them if you wish to save Sparta from the cult's control. See you in the throne room. <sighs> what?
What are we waiting for? Sorry to keep you waiting. You summoned the Air Force? You must have achieved some success to earn this adoring crowd. I brought home a wreath for Sparta. Though, I had to enter the games and win it myself. Very good. But what of our Pankration champion, Testicles? There was an accident at sea before he could compete. Games are hardly important. What about Viotia? Stentor and I defeated the Athenian forces. You have nothing to worry about. If you have nothing but good news to share, why did you call for the Air Force? We were told serious charges would be brought. Serious charges? Against whom? You act as if you don't know. Against you, Pafsanias. I have traveled Spartan lands and beyond, and found proof of Pafsanias' betrayal. He's a member of the cult of Cosmos. These traitors are willing to kill hundreds, to rule thousands. Here's all the proof you need. Proof? What proof? So the rumors are true. We never would have thought a king could be so dishonorable. Honor belongs to history. You deserve death. How for dare your you crimes. threaten a king? Absalias, you are king no more. As of this day, you are exiled from Sparta. Before Athena and Eris, I swear you'll regret this. Justice will be done. You'll have your justice, puppet king. Forgive us, my king. My daughter couldn't let him stay in power any longer. Of course not. You've more than earned your citizenship. Sparta owes you thanks and releases your home unto you. Your home is returned. Our home, now. Let us leave the court to its business. We'll talk outside. As for Pavsanias, it would be wise to deal with him as soon as possible. I will. He is a cultist, after all. When you've dealt with him, meet me at Leonidas's tomb. I must show you something important. I'll find you there, Mater. King Pavsanias is part of the cult of Cosmos. I'll have to kill him myself. <laughs>
Everyone on my crew, including you. What's gone? There was a skull here, a small rabbit skull, from your first hunt. Why would someone take that? There is only one person who would have taken it. Nikolaos. Maybe seeing each other again made him think of this place. It did the same to me. Seems I wasn't the only one yearning for home. I hope I'm not intruding. Prasidas, come in. It's good to see the two of you back home. It feels good to be here. You're here instead of in training. What's wrong? I'm heading to Pilos as soon as I can. I think you may want to come as well. I'd be happy to return the favor. What's waiting for us in Pilos? Glory. The Athenians are pushing the Spartans back even as we speak. It would be a devastating loss for Sparta, and I can't allow that to happen. It sounds like you've lost confidence in Sparta's warriors. They're as strong as they've ever been. But now they're facing a power they can't even imagine. Do you mean Vimos? Yes, that's what the rumors say. A force of nature in the body of a mortal who can cut down any soldier in his path. If Vimos is in Pylos, we have to stop him. I'll wait for you at the ship, but be quick. Each moment we waste is another Spartan dead. Alexios is in Pylos. You have to bring him back, Cassandra. Bring him back? We have our home again. We can be a family. It isn't too late. I'll do what I can, Mother. But I can't promise anything. Please, don't say that yet. The cult of Cosmos has had too much time with him. He is beyond reason. Isn't it worth trying everything we can? And if I can't save my brother? Then we will have tried. We thought him dead for so long. I refuse to give up just yet. I'll do what I can. I should leave for Pilos now. Be safe, Cassandra. <laughs> 